One challenge in a lot of data mining analysis is when the numbers in different attributes are on very different scales. Normalization is a resolution for this. So for many data mining techniques using numeric data, you might have very large scales that overwhelm smaller scales. So for instance, you might have a data set where you have uh, people, uh, perhaps customers, and you have income information ranging from maybe 10,000 euros to 100,000 euros in your family, in your data set. But then you also have their family size. So family sizes might be one, two, three, five, six, maybe even up to eight or nine as the largest number in your data set. So you have information about income that goes from 10,000 out to up to 100,000, and then you have family size that goes to a maximum of eight or nine. Now, when you do a lot of uh, analysis with uh, various techniques, the computer algorithm looks at the larger scale with hundreds and thousands and will completely ignore the smaller scale will just single digits and because the numbers are so much larger from a business perspective however this might be very problematic because maybe in your particular application the size of the family really matters in determining what you're trying to predict or analyze and the income might be important but maybe of secondary importance but techniques that are swayed by this will completely ignore the larger numbers so techniques that are influenced like this such as kami's cluster analysis outlier detection among others require the normalization of data and normalization means uh, a, a very simple arithmetic uh, transformation of each of these data points where you subtract the mean of the attribute from all the numbers in that attribute and then you divide by the standard deviation uh, the result is that the numbers become scaled to generally from minus three to three whether you're talking about income or family size uh, and 99 percent of the data uh, will be within those ranges minus three to three assuming you have a gaussian normal distribution a bell-shaped curve distribution only one percent would be outside of those the very extremely high or extremely low values and uh, with that since everything is on scale minus three plus three income can now have the same weight as family size and the algorithm can take all of them into uh, appropriate consideration now one challenge with normalization is that it's hard to interpret incomes from minus three to plus three so to then interpret the results you would normally need to denormalize which means converting them back to their original values so that they can be easily interpreted and normalization is usually a technique that is often included in many uh, analysis packages with a click of a button or sometimes with special operators but is a very standard procedure in data mining and analytics